guys, and welcome to a new episode of Spin Tires with Dubstep Sheep. This is going to be my third and final game that I play on my YouTube channel. I will probably add more games maybe a, a long time down the road. But this is my first attempt at playing uh, Spin Tires here. Um, today I'd like to kind of go through some mods that I had installed recently on uh, Spin Tires. <coughs> Uh, for those of you who do not know what spin tires is, spin tires is basically a truck driving game that is very, very detailed in the texturing of the uh, of the landscape and the um, kind of the dirt and everything that you go over. Everything is very detailed. Hold on, let me just turn up my sound real quick. There we go, that's a little bit better. Uh, everything is very detailed, and it's kind of like a mud uh, game. You can drive your trucks in the mud, have a great grand old time. But uh, right now I installed some mods. You're only seeing one right now, because all these other trucks are default in the game. But this, this little rock crawler thing right here is a mod that I just installed, and this thing is a beast. Just wait, wait till you see this thing drive. Oh, the parking brake's on. This thing will go through mud like no tomorrow, I just gotta tell you. Water, eh, if it's not super deep, it can handle, but. Mud, rocks, hills, anything it can go through fairly quickly, as you are seeing right now. Once it hits water, it slows down a bit, but relatively okay so far. Doing just fine. Let's turn on our headlights. Ooh, those are really bright. Now this mod uh, does not support um, front camera view like the other trucks do because it was made before the update was made for the uh, front camera and the horn were implemented in the game, so that does not support that unfortunately. Uh, but this is a really, really uh, neat little truck and it goes really, really, really fast and it's great for just kind of tooling around and stuff. As you can see, we're going very quickly here. It's kind of mud bogging. We'll zoom. Oh, I can't zoom in anymore, actually. It's almost too hard to, too fast to see the details. Because there is a motion blur effect in this game. Let's take it through this stuff. Won't be a problem at all. Just splashes right through. After this, I will show you the uh, Ford F-350 Brute Terror, and it really is a Brute Terror, it's a pretty beastly truck. It's not quite as fast as this thing, but it's still pretty cool. And then, lastly, I will show you the Ford 1939 pickup. Now we're going to avoid this water, what we're going to do is watch this. We're going to drive up on the side here. And we're still good. And we're not stuck. <laughs> nice. Let's up this hill. Your leads. <coughs> yeah, but this game is uh, very, very fun. There is a multiplayer to this game. This game is also available on Steam. Uh, and the mods are fairly easy to install, actually. You can install maps, trucks, uh, and other items as well. I get a better view of the truck here. Oh, man. Oh dear, we flipped her. Oh jeez. Oh boy. 
That was a close one. Wish I could would have gotten a better view of that. We did take a little bit of damage. But it wasn't that bad. And we just keep going. This thing's like a little boom buggy. Just keeps going. Oh, oh, look at that mud splash up. The mud really kills you, or kills your speed if you're going full speed down a hill and then you just smush in the mud and just sprays up and you hit the ground hard enough you're gonna take a more damage, but just kinda explore. Don't wanna go too far away from where we are. Okay. Okay. Ooh, that's a pretty intense hill. Let's go check it out. I'll turn around once I get to the top. Crawls up the hill without any problem. Speeding along. and take a right once we hit the bottom of the hill again. We can catch air off this little hump here. Wish we had a speedometer because we're going really fast right now. Holy moly, I almost lose control here. I think that mud was there. So you can see we just took a huge stop. I have a feeling there's a really big hill somewhere up here. Hmm. I wonder. Let's just try it. Go, 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 go! <laughs> Ooh, it's digging in, it's digging in. Is it even possible I can dig myself into the... Look at this, I'm totally submerged. I don't know if I'll be able to get out. I can't even reverse. Oh, jeez. I'm stuck forever. Look at this. I just buried myself. This might help a little bit. Probably not, though. wonder if there's a winch point anywhere near us. And no. <laughs> Oh, we're never gonna get out of here. <laughs> oh man, this is great. Okay, well, <clears throat> what we can do is we can actually head her back to the garage. Yeah, that did not work. <laughs> Let's just take a look at our map real quick. The big hill we were on before was over here. Eh, oh well. Well that was the rock crawler right there. It was it's an intense little vehicle. Love driving it. Uh okay, let's go with the coast. Some it's you kinda have to guess because the the trucks spawn yeah uh, randomly. Okay, here's the I can show you the, um, uh, let's turn off the engine and let's change it to this beast. There you go. The Ford F-350 Brute Terror. 
There it is. Let's start it up. Let's increase volume here and see what that sounds like. Oh. Ooh. Some of that diesel. Yeah, that's definitely a diesel. Oh, we're going to need parking brake off. Okay, let's see. What does rear exhaust look like? I just want to... Even bigger tires. <laughs> you can put other trailers on here, too, and... Uh, let me just see what the rear exhaust looks like. Oh, it's just right out the end. We don't want that. We want these. That's what we want right there. Oh, look at that black snow pour out. Now, this thing will get going pretty quick if you get into a straight line. You just have to give it a second. There we go. Get her in gear, second gear here. Now we're cruising. This thing's a beast. It can haul a lot. And actually hauled, uh... I hauled, uh... The Gooseneck trailer. Let's stop for a second here. I want to turn the sound on. I just wanted to have it... Whoop. just wanted to have it uh, a little bit louder for the... For the, um, startup. But anyway, I had the Gooseneck trailer. Let's take a look at the map real quick. The Gooseneck... Now where would this go? So, we want to keep going straight. I had the gooseneck trailer. And I was hauling that little uh, rock crawler deal on there. It actually took me a couple tries to get him up onto the trailer, but I finally got it. Some mud bog in here. It's doing pretty well. Not bad, not bad. Look at those nice LED headlights. Believe it or not, the uh, Ford 1939 truck is actually way faster than this thing. I'm not really sure why, but. <clears throat> it is really much faster. But we'll get to that in a second. Let's keep showing me off the um, nice little uh, Ford here. There we go. Oh, look. Just rumble down the trees. Oh, a little water pile. Or not water pile. What am I saying? Water puddle. A little creek or something. Holy moly, we just took a dig. Into the water. And this is a cloaking point. This will uh, unlock parts of the map for you to view if you look, now this whole section of the map is viewable. Whereas before it was all covered in black like the rest of this part is. So these little cloaking spots, you drive into them and you will unlock parts of the map. Okay. We could actually probably find the uh, Ford or the other Ford pickup 1939 one on here. Because they will spawn randomly around the map for you to pick up and stuff, and you can drive them. 
Na perna, na perna. We're coming to an open area up here, so we'll see where we're headed. Oh, geez, we're taking some air here, guys. This looks pretty interesting. Let's go check it out. I think we're gonna drive our truck off the edge just for funsies. Not sure if there's a big drop off or not. Not really. Just a big lake. I'm not gonna drive through that. No way. Just we'll just drown ourselves. Oh, took some damage from that big old boulder. Then we'll aim ourselves for that uh, big old <coughs> mud puddle over there. Getting up the hill, no problem. Going around this corner, let's keep exploring a little bit, see what's up ahead. This truck is real great for pulling stuff too. Like I was saying earlier, I was pulling the gooseneck trailer. There's also like a log trailer, I believe. You can look, our, we got some damage to the back of our truck. Slowing down just a tad, but we're not getting stuck. That's for sure. The only way we'd get stuck probably is if we took off our uh, differential lock and our all wheel drive. That would get us stuck. Maybe not. Yeah, but you can turn on your differential lock and your all wheel drive if your truck has that option. We're going to want that on though for driving here. There we go, switch gears here. <laughs> as soon as we hit the mod, it just switches back to one. It automatically switches gears when it, uh, you get to a different type of terrain, but you can manually switch, switch the gears using the R key. And I'm not going to show you that right now, because you have to be in second gear to switch into any higher gear. So, because otherwise your engine stalls. Makes perfect sense. Well, I think we'll pull her out of this little area, and then we'll try to see if we can find the next truck. A little bit sure out of the mud here. Let's switch up our headlights. Wait, did we get stuck? No, we didn't get stuck. It just looked like we did. Yeah, we're good. Well, hold up a second and we'll... Is that clearing over there? Let's 
going to this clearing area. Right it's like a good spot. Up this hill or whatever. You can see we took some damage from that uh, boulder. Ooh, here's a good spot to drive down. A big old lake. Actually, Banzai! <laughs> go, go, go! Drive! <laughs> Drive downhill, drive downhill. Oh, oh geez, you're taking some rock damage here. There you have it. That's the uh, um the F three fifty brute terror. Oh man, we took a big hit to our front, but you get the idea for that one. It's a pretty nice mod, I like it a lot. It comes with some trailers and bigger tires and stuff like you saw at the beginning and then lastly the uh... let's see lastly the nineteen oh they were perfect we got right to it the Ford 1939 pickup and you get all you get here is uh... just bigger tires if you look at the default they're pretty standard and then you get these bigger tires I don't know if I've ever done the default tires. Eh, let's just try it. And let's kind of get like a camera view here. Pretty nice truck. But wait till you see the speed on this thing. Once it switches gears. Holy moly. It starts out slow. You gotta give it a second. We'll switch to second gear. And then it'll cruise. Just wait. Uh, well, now, not right now, but it's not very loud either. Mm, don't worry, we'll get to it. It'll switch gears from time to time. We just have to give it a second. See how it stops a little bit. But once it gets going, it really hauls. It's actually, I think, faster than the. Uh, it's for sure faster than the. Um, how would you call it? The Ford F three fifty. And it might be even faster than the than the um, uh, rock crawler. It might be even faster than that. But I'm not positive though. This mud is really, really deep, so we're not gonna go fast anywhere. Let's switch to a uh, one plus for our gears. Just going a little bit quicker. Oh. Starting to gain some traction here. The road's kind of driving us right now. We're getting pushed around in the ruts. You can see here. Our back end's swinging a little bit. Not too bad, though. Once we hit flatter ground, we'll pick up speed for sure. And we're almost out of there. And we're kicking up a lot of mud, holy moly. We should build like a mud cloud mod or something. 
Just plow in the mud. Jeez. I don't think I should have gone this way. Oh well. I'm gonna cross the lake here pretty soon. Nice little Ford icon. The models of these mods are done really good. Very, very well. Whoever made these. Down the hill. Oh, we're almost there. If you listen carefully, you can hear the birds and stuff in the background, or animals. Uh, I think it's Uvi that made this game. He's done a really, really good job of making this game. All the detailing and everything. Uh, I mean, the water, everything, the mud. I mean, watch this. Oh, jeez. And look at the detailing of everything. It's just grand. Alright, just a smoke a little bit from the water. I think we'll keep. Uh, I don't know, I can go straight with it to go left. Not really sure where this goes at all. There's a stone right there. there we go. Now we're starting to pick up speed. Our engine almost stalled there for a second. Just have to keep watch out for trees and such like that. Ah, here's a good area to go. This is perfect at this play. There we go. Now you can see we're starting to pick up speed. And now we're going actually pretty quick. As we're in fifth gear already. Let's go explore up this hill. Got a huge bolt in there. This truck isn't bad. I love the handling. It's very uh, precise handling and stuff. Nice little truck. Oof. A little bit of a sharp turn there. Just wanted to see what was up here. It's not very exciting, so I'm going to head back down. Oh, hit a tree. We're going to head back down here. I like this little open area, it's perfect for just cruising around. There are some occasional rocks and stuff but that you can deal with that though. Those kind of kill your speed, but it's not like you can't handle it. Good suspension on this thing, you can see the, the uh, springs and stuff. See if we can make it up this hill. Bet you a little million dollars we can. Yep, we can. <laughs> Holy moly, we just took a huge amount of air. Whoa, that was intense. That was a great jump over that hill. Let's do that again. Let's see if we can get the speed up. Oh man, I'd like to try that in my rock crawler. Ooh, let's climb on damage from that darn little pine tree. Okay. Nice little Ford truck. I like this thing a lot. Ooh, hoo -hoo, look at our door. The frame completely broke. Oh, dear. Oh, man. <laughs> I just killed our truck. Oh, smashed into a pine tree. 
And of course, I don't have any add ons to repair, but man. Well, there you go. Uh, damaged 1939 Ford pickup. You can see we were beating it down pretty hard. But yeah, once you get uh, full damage down here, you can see the red line. But um, if you have add ons that you can repair with, you can get your truck up to at least somewhat working order. But of course, this truck doesn't have add ons. So and you can rescue it back to your garage and you just have to kind of start over. But um, yeah, so that was the uh, um, first episode of Spin Tires. If you like Spin Tires, uh, please like, comment, subscribe. Um, uh, hope you like all the mods that I got to show you. And uh, thanks for watching. And as always, have a great day. Need our little mouse here. <laughs>